All right, guys, look, it's 2022. I think it's about time. It's about time to step out of our little boxes that we've kept ourselves in for far too long and start thinking differently. You know, start dismantling those stereotypes we hold so closely and start looking at the gaming world a little bit differently. <laughs> Welcome to the channel, gamers. My name is Tacti. This, this right here, what you're seeing, is exactly what you think it is. It's Roblox. Now, before you hit the unsubscribe button and click the next video, hear me out here. This game with the Roblox engine is completely free and is a lot of fun. I know Roblox gets a lot of flack because when you think of that game, you think of a bunch of, I don't know, 10 year olds yelling at each other and doing whatever it is that the base game of Roblox does. I, I honestly don't know when I'm writing the script what Roblox actually originally was intended to be. I just know that right now it's a giant modding platform that has created numerous games and mods. Just look at all these. I cannot believe that this many mods or spinoffs or whatever the heck they are exist. Now this exact project, which is linked down below if you want to check it out, is called Frontlines. It's a demo available on the Roblox engine for anybody to play whenever they want. It's an online multiplayer only game demo at the moment and it's created by Maximilian. It's obviously received some great attention and with good reason. Imagine nearly all the movements, the weapon mechanics, the gorgeous environments, and the animations from Modern Warfare 2019 and put them on the Roblox engine. That's what's happening here. The game currently has very little as far as content goes, though I will go over what's available here in a second. But again, you can literally just try this game out for yourself whenever you want because it's free. Like I mentioned, I have never used Roblox in any way, shape, or form up until today, but I do know that it's a very, very simple installation process that takes very little time because the Roblox engine is not a very large engine in itself, so you hardly have any time out of your life doing this and you'll see for yourself what the game is like. For this channel, I'm always looking for free or interesting games for cheap outside of the AAA development sphere because number one, not everyone is strapped with cash all the time, and number two, AAA developers hate you because as much money as they spend on research and what the human brain wants and how it can be manipulated, they still aren't able to convince you that Battlefield 2042 is good or the NFTs are the wave of the future. So this is one of those games. If you decide to hop on and play, this is what you get. A very bare bones experience when it comes to gunplay, but right now it's only a demo. It's a simple click and play and then you spawn in with the randomized weapon to shoot bad guys with. Sprinting, tactical sprinting, sliding, ADS reloads, suppressed weapons, just a lot of the standard things that you would expect in shooters. At the moment, there aren't any kinds of kill streaks or anything like that. I hope that they add them in the future. It seems like a good way to go with it. But there are grenades, just regular grenades, no flashbangs yet. The queue doesn't work. There are a few different game modes that you can play as well. Team Deathmatch, King of the Hill, and Domination are the three that I've seen in my short time playing. There may be more, but I don't know. You get to vote at the end of every round, so that's how you decide which game mode is next. There are only currently two different maps, a port map and a canyon map. I prefer the desert one just because I love the desert, <laughs> and the port one I believe was the one just added. What's insane to me in general is the Roblox engine. This is all on that engine, and it's crazy to me that the games can look this good and have these kind of mechanics all in one engine that's super easy to run. I'm honestly probably going to explore a little bit more to see if I can't find some other cool games like this that would fit this channel. So if you have any recommendations, if you've played the game before, just let me know down below and I'll take a look. But this kind of thing right here, the default Roblox engine, the default platform, I'm hoping that Blue Drake's Operation Harsh Doorstop will take this kind of route. It's essentially the same idea. Operation Harsh Doorstop will be a game, but most importantly is going to be a platform for people to mod and create their own games. It's gonna be a platform for both single player and multiplayer game modes that is, you know, decently easy to run, but also has the ability to look really, really good. If you think this looks good right now on the Roblox engine, just imagine an upgraded, more realistic style of engine. I've got really high hopes for that game and who knows, maybe I'll think about trying to fund a game of my own based on that. We'll see how everything uh, turns out. And hopefully with that, like the Roblox engine here, there's going to be an easy browser that will be available so that you can hop into any game you want to play just like that game. I'm pretty sure Blue Drake said that that's his plan for the future, but that's probably down the road quite a bit. For right now, I'm just going to play a quick round of this game so you can see how much of a sweaty gamer I am. And I'll be playing on the new port map, a decent game, but it doesn't matter. I don't claim to be great, nor do I care about being great at first person shooters. This is just so you understand what the game looks like and how it plays. But check this game out down below for yourself. 
And until the next one, be bold, be courageous, stay tactical. All right, we ready? It's the MP5. Look at that. Tactical sprint. Let's go. We're not messing around. Let's go. The time to kill seems pretty low as well. I like the tactical. I'm going to go upstairs. See what I can see. I've even got my sensitivity up. I'm ready to go. Yep. There's my sweaty aim. Come on. Where are you at? Gotcha. You pick up ammo. You heal. Slide down the stairs, just like Call of Duty. Yep. See that? Phase Clan. No friendly fire. Not exactly a tactical game, I know. Ooh. Oh, he got me. All right, what weapon do we have now? Suppressed M4. Those don't show up on the uh, mini map, by the way. Suppressed weapons. Whoa. Where's he at? We'll chuck a grenade just in case. Oh, did I see someone on the left side? I hear him. Oh, come on. I should have had him. Oh, did he just spawn in? He sure did. He spawned right in front of me. The maps look good, man. Look at this. I mean, even the Roblox character, what he's wearing, that's <laughs> looks good. Hello, sir. Couldn't see the blue. There we go. Let's heal up a little bit. Heal up a little bit. Goodbye. Like the weapon model. Oh. Woo. It's good aim. The weapon models look really, really good. And what's cool, I mean, not a lot of games do this right now. You ADS and reload. All right, so we're playing King of the Hill. Our goal is to capture that, I guess. I haven't really been playing the objectives, just running around shooting people because that's more fun. A lot of guys. Oh, oh. Weird physics, but okay. Nineteen shots. You think I can get him with nineteen shots? He died. But they should be coming this way. Yep. Just looking at the map there. I think I need a new uh Oh, there's one over here too. Nope. I'm dead. Okay, we got an MP five now, Woodstock. I wonder, there's no uh, customization in here yet. But I wonder how that, what that's going to be like. I wonder how it's balanced. There's a good one. Oh, should have stayed. I think I need to get me a new keyboard because uh, sometimes that uh, tactical sprint is really hard for me to hit. Check all of them. Go around the outside. See if we can't sneak up on them. That's quite the slide, too. Oh, oh boy. Where's where's my uh, where's the rest of my barrel, guys? It must be. Just procedurally generated. Oh, 
Oop. What's, uh, what's melee, I wonder? I haven't looked at it. Okay, V. Ooh. Hey, yeah, yeah. Really? Quick knife there. Come over here. I like these weapon models, man. I can't get over them. They look really, really good. Sweat. I wish there was a healing mechanic and some kill streaks and stuff, but yeesh. They're after me, huh? I use a uh, membrane keyboard to be quiet. Oh, let's chuck one. They're probably going to be gone soon, but we're still going to try to flank them. There we go. All right. There's one game for you.